Quilter Select Cutaway is a beautiful mesh product that comes on a roll that is not stretchy. It's very, very firm. Also, one side of it has a very light fusible, the inside that comes off the roll, and then the outside doesn't have that. So what might a quilter use this for? Well, let's talk t-shirt quilts. Everybody loves t-shirt quilts. They bring back such great memories. When you're making a t-shirt quilt, it's very important to stabilize the fabric because t-shirts are stretchy. So before you cut the patch to exactly the size you want to be, you make a rough cut. Then you take this quilter select and you iron the fusible side to the underneath side of the t-shirt. Then you trim it to the exact size you want. Who doesn't want a t-shirt quilt? But here's another application that I think is really cool. Do you like finished applique, but you don't want to do needle turn? Well, this works beautifully with that. So what you would do is you would get the shape you want. I cut this shape just by making a circle, folding it, and then cutting around. And I have this adorable, adorable flower shape. And then I have a circle and I have two leaves. What you need to do after you get the shape you want is put it underneath this beautiful, beautiful sheer cutaway and trace on it like with a felt tip pen. After you've traced on it, then what you'll do is you will take it and you will layer it to the right side of the fabric, shiny side up, and then stitch completely around on your sewing machine. Once it is completely stitched, then you're going to go cut like this, about a quarter of an inch, maybe a little less. And then if there's any's, just cut yourself a little V. Once you've done that, then you're carefully going to take your scissors and cut the, the beautiful webbing, not your flower, and then you're going to turn it inside out and finesse all the curves and all the innies and all the outies. There we go. And I, this takes me truly about five minutes to get it the way I want it. But look at this. It's absolutely beautiful. When you get it finessed so that the curves are perfect, remember, whatever the curves are, that's what is going to be. Then you fuse again, and now it makes it nice and crisp and even. The last thing you can do is you can, if you want, cut away this just to about a quarter inch, or oh, maybe maybe a half an inch, and then you have none of the cutaway back here. So that's what I did with these leaves. Let's see, this one I cut out. It's so sheer, you can barely see it. This one I chose to leave in. It doesn't matter. You can do one way or the other. Then you go to your background, you put it down, you can applique by hand, you can applique by machine. The choice is yours and you'll end up with a beautiful finished edge applique. Now I am sure as you play with this product and explore it, you'll find many other creative ways to use this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful product brought to you by Quilters Select.